Hello, so if you have a problem with your Elegoo Mercury, where when you turn it on, the motor starts spinning, but after a second or so, it just goes brrrr, then this is how you fixed it. I've had this problem a couple of times, and this is how I solved it. Basically, there's a disc inside that spins, and it's rubbing on the top of the housing. So you need to turn it upside down, take out all the screws. Quite easy, you need a Allen key for that. Take it apart, don't electrocute yourself, that's not my fault if you do that. And then you'll see there's m some more screws, I've already done this one, that hold the motor in place. Undo those, take the whole motor out, just four more screws, it's quite straightforward. Then once you've got that, you will see that is the disc that is rubbing on the top of the housing. And you'll see, if you look closely, just there, there's a tiny little screw that holds it in place and it's probably slipped. So you need to undo that screw a little bit and... On mine, it was actually completely undone. Just fasten it up again. If you over tighten it, it can make the disc a little bit wonky. Um, so you might want to actually add some washers under there or something like that. But there you go, you see I'm tightening up there. That's all you need. You'll see this is where I decided to add a washer, which actually that washer didn't fit. I made one out of paper, which I'm hoping won't catch fire. This is done entirely at your own risk, obviously. Uh, and that's about it. So you just, all that you then need to do is put it all back together. Put the thing back in place and you will see, once you turn it on, it spins perfectly. Here we go. And it gets up to speed. Sorry about the mess in my studio. There you go. It spins all up to speed, all fixed. Just have to tighten it up. I've had this happen twice on these machines. First one I sent back, the second one was out of warranty. So I had to fix it and I hope that works for you. Bye.